There's your third eye. Perfectly round and open, really pink. I'm going to get this picture too. Well, as far as what you're supposed to be doing right now, um, all I can say is wait for the call, I guess. Because you're in the right place doing the right thing right now. So wherever your mission leads you, it, I think you will just be guided. Your, um, your spirit guides are very... Um, this one, she's really strong, and that one, she's subtle, but they're both female. Of course. You told me last time I had divine feminism in my crown chakra, remember? Yeah. Now there's two females in there? Yes. No! Mm -hmm. Maybe she's one of them. <laughs> oh yeah, that's it. That is. Very good. She's very strong. But, um... I mean, you're gonna, you're gonna get there. I just can't tell you what it is exactly or where you're gonna be, but you're on the path. It's going wherever you're supposed to go. So don't let yourself get too frustrated. Easier said than done, I know, but. You know, you could really give advice. Look at that. Now they just changed again. See, they popped out for a second, those two females. But they're telling you, they're saying that, you know, you, 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 um, you have this very uh, humanitarian energy about you. Very That's what all that pink is. That pink energy means that you're going to take all that physical energy and do something in a physical way that's going to affect other people in a positive way. What's going on? I don't know. That, uh, that, that was why well, I had a question. I was like, how am I going to figure out what's going on in my head? I got to go see my friend down at the Alexandria Institute. Because I was sitting at the cabin up there, and the, they're all, I was like, oh my God, what is that? I can't, you can't go to the hospital for that. Mm -hmm. and, and then it popped in my head, oh, I got to go see my, I got to go see my future ex wife. But there's, but there's nothing wrong. There's everything uh, is good. Well, no, but I didn't know what kind of energy it was. It's was it's, it it's not bad energy or no, was it good energy? I didn't it's know. It's not bad. Well, I didn't know. It's just this 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 passion for um, something that you're supposed to be doing, and it's going to be put, uh, requiring you to put a lot of physical energy into it, and it will have to do with um, being of service to others. Humanitarian efforts. So let's see. I'm gonna have to put this thing in my lap. How are you feeling physically? Um, I did Kundalini yoga for my first time, so I'm <laughs> sore. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm 37 years old. Are you kidding me? This girl is 28. She's like, so what? Hey. She's, like, she's like, you need, you need these cushions and these, and these uh, straps. And I'm like, are you trying to insult me? Look, uh. I will grab whatever I need later, okay? Look, I am 37, and I feel in perfect health. You, I feel you healthier are. than you are. I feel healthier than you right now. She's like, what? Man, I just drove 12 hours from Santa Rosa's here and take this class. And she's all, oh, you did? I'm like, no, I did that yesterday. Uh. But I didn't get a good night's sleep last night. You didn't? No. I never sleep good in a hotel bed the first night. Got to get used to it, and then you sit in the second night. But it was seventy-five dollars last night, so I'm not paying that again. <clears throat> well, this one's really good. They're all really good. They're just like you should take these pictures back to her and say, "This is what I'm talking about." Oh, here's the thing. I said, "I said, look, I need some healing. Do you do healing work too?" She said, "Yeah." And I went, "Okay, cool." How much do you charge? She said, "I charge seventy-five dollars an hour," and I went. What? See, you could be charging seventy-five dollars an hour. I'm. Uh, I'm. Did you do barter? She's a barter what? And I was like, well, I don't know. What do you want? Because I don't charge 
anything for the healing work that I do on people. Right. So, uh, hmm. But you don't need to. I mean, I mean, you could. I don't. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. I mean, that's what it's for. You got to manifest it somehow. Oh, I know. I'm going to Mexico City. Really? Yeah. I, uh, I, can find, I have a place to stay in Mexico City. Have you been there? Nope. Let's see. I think I won't have, won't have a problem. I won't have a problem. I'm good. I can learn how to speak Spanish, though. Mexico City, is that the place? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Is it Mexico City, guys? I Wait. think so. Isn't that the heart of the Americas? Ooh. Artistic, oh, geez, artistic, physical, creative, expression, excitement. Excited, yay. Mm -hmm. So after I told her that her chakras were open, I was like, look, I'm gonna give you a crystal. What's your zodiac sign? She says, I'm a Taurus. I'm like, oh, I'm a Capricorn. You know, I didn't, in my head, I'm all Capricorn, mm -hmm. both Earth, cool. And so I was like, oh, well, what, there's 2,500 crystals in the world. Which ones are your Taurus ones? You should know I at know. least more than one. And she's like, I don't know any, really. The, and I went, the dog just did a poop over there, but don't worry. No, I'll pick, I'll pick it up. I got it. it just, yeah. uh, I got it. I just to let you know, um, Steve has the point of the uh, 3.15. Oh, really? Okay. Well, we got to wrap it up. Okay. Sweet. Alright. Close your eyes, take a deep breath. Ooh. Why so red? So let's talk about what's going on in your head. It's going on right now. That's why it's changed. That's why it's fresh. I know. I see that. I, if I stop, do it again. Wow, that's amazing. So how have you been? That's amazing. It's really amazing what you're doing. How you been? I'm good. I've been great. Going through a lot of stuff, but really, really good. And you? You're still up north? No. I got, I got here yesterday. <clears throat> and you're here to stay now? No. I don't, know, I don't know what I'm doing. It's whichever way they, um, they tell me to go. Who's ever putting this pressure in my head? And what do you think they're telling you? I don't know. I think it's Morse code because it impulses. <laughs> 